Hi everyone, it's Lisa and welcome to Proverbs Home. I hope you're having a great day. Part of being a homemaker is when we go out and we find discounts, when we shop, when we find something that we can use for very inexpensive. That is part of being a homemaker. And that's why when I go out shopping, now I don't share everything. There's many times I go out, you know, we go food shopping and stuff. I'll share some things that I find at the Ben and Dent, but I really don't share all my groceries and stuff. But this is a Dollar Tree haul and I found some good items and I wanted to share those with you. Go on ahead and let's start with the first bag. This is the Carrot Patch Pete. His name is Pete from Palmer. This is three ounces of chocolate and it is so adorable. These are for my grandkids. This is gonna go in their Easter basket. Look at the cute carrots there on the bunny. Isn't that adorable? And I like these boxes. They are so cute. I was thinking, what would be a good thing to reuse these boxes for instead of throwing them out? You know, you can use them for anything. They are absolutely adorable. So cute. And what I like about these, they have games on the back that you can play. So they have like a little maze on the back. These boxes, they get me all the time. They're just so adorable. But I did get these for my grandkids so they can enjoy themselves and have a nice piece of chocolate on Easter. And then these we broke into already. These are the Lance Nuggets. And this is like a lemon cream cookie. These are so good. Let me show you what they look like. This is what they look like. And they have lemon cream inside. They are delicious. Now, my husband and I, we broke into these already because we love lemon cookies. You know what they remind me of? Animal cookie with lemon cream. That's what they remind me of, but they call nuggets. And they're from the company Lance, where we get some of the other crackers from with the cheese and chai. I also got the cinnamon raisin Ellie's bagels. And there's one, two, three, four bagels in there. So I picked these up. I thought for a dollar for four bagels, that's really good. My husband and I, we like bagels. We don't eat them all the time, but we do enjoy them. So I bought four and for $1.25, that is a great deal. Okay, let's see what else is here. Ooh, we got the Rice Krispies Bunny. Now, we ate one already in the car as soon as we got them. They're good. They're good. I wish they had a little bit more of the Rice Krispie Crunch, but these are really good. They did have the Flintstones, which is the Fruity Pebbles white chocolate. I almost got those. I had those before and we liked them, but I wanted to try these. And these are from the company Frankfurt and Kellogg's Milk Chocolate Bunny. Oh, I got some special high true fruit candies. These are good. And these are for me though. These are gonna be in my craft room. I like having a little snack in my craft room. And these are absolutely delicious. It says immensely fruity, intensely chewy candy. And those look really good. So you know, get yourself a little treat at the Dollar Tree that you can just put in your craft room. Sometimes when you're doing a DIY or craft, you know, I like to have my water in here um, and have a little snack in case I get hungry when I'm doing a DIY. And then I got the Chips Ahoy. And these are also going to my grandkids' um, baskets. I got the crunchy ones and I got the chewy ones. They're around there somewhere in a red bag. And those will go for either one. And then I found the Martha White muffin mix. Now, I love getting these muffin mixes, and the reason is because I just add milk. And I like them, and I like adding my own berries. I add extra blueberries, extra strawberries, and they are absolutely delicious. I think I picked up four of these. I also got the Norris rice. I love getting these. These are a quick fix for us. You know, all day and we're tired, I'll come home and throw this and cook this with some vegetables, a piece of chicken or something. And the Norris brand is very good. And this is the chicken flavor rice and pasta blend and a savory chicken sauce. Mm. My friend's husband, we're celebrating, well, her, his wife is celebrating his birthday. And, um, I am going to be making a spice platter, beef platter, and I got the jalapenos. This is sliced jalapeno peppers, MS Trader is the name of the company. And this is going to be on the platter. Then I'm going to keep the jar. Right? That's a great way to buy a jar. To buy a jar for canning or for doing jams and stuff. Go to the Dollar Tree, you buy something you can use, and then you have the jar also. The Santitas Hot Salsa. 
that's gonna also go part of the platter. I'm gonna add some cheese to the salsa, make like a kind of dip. But this is the hot food. I got the lime juice. Now I have my lemon juice that I use for dehydrating, for cooking and stuff. And I there's some recipes that call for lime juice. And I'm like, I need to pick some of that up for $1.25. That isn't bad. So I picked up a lime juice and I'm gonna keep these. I love these containers. They're so pretty. You could use them for decor also around the house. Rosemary chocolate fudge. So I got the chocolate and I got the vanilla chocolate and vanilla okay now let's go to the next bag are you ready for the next bag here's the next bag I picked up some salsitas and this goes with this it's the same company and I picked up two bags and these are for the platter that I'm making and this is spicy salsa And then I picked up more of the North Spanish rice. I'm so. Now I got some treats. This is the dark chocolate raspberry cream filled. These are for my husband. He loves dark chocolate, absolutely loves dark chocolate. So I picked these up for him so he can enjoy these. Poor Drew, dark chocolates. He loves these. And I saw them and I picked one up and you can tell he got into them already. So he got into them in the car. So these are the Queen Anne's. These are the ones that they sell for Christmas. Well, they have them now also. If you're into these cordials, you would really like these. I'm a Twizzler girl, 100%. I love Twizzlers, but I am going to put some of these in my grandkids' Easter basket, and I'm going to keep a couple for me. I love having Twizzlers. I don't buy them all the time, but if they're around or somebody has a pack or we have some at Children's Church, I'll have one. But I do love me some Twizzlers, and they're also a good snack. They're not high on calories. And I got, this is the Chip Ahoy's that I told you I got for my grandkids. So that's going to go in one of the Easter baskets. And I think this is the last of the treats of the food. I got the Chocolate Chocolate Covered Marshmallows. These are also going to go in the Easter baskets. But guess what? You know me. Every time I do a haul, what do I do? If I have chocolate, I try it. I love these marshmallow chocolates. Mmm so good so i got now i found these cute bunnies these are gonna go on my seasonal tree i'm gonna diy them and make ornaments out of them look how cute these are them you can put them in your greenhouse you can put them in your garden these are just really really cute these are from the dollar tree I might put some in my garden, in my greenhouse, so get a couple of more packs because these are so pretty. I couldn't believe they had these there and they're really nice. So I got two packs of these because there's three in a package. Now I do have to say this and I wanted to make this disclaimer before I go on. I got one more bag and then we're done. I am a Christian and I believe in resurrection Sunday, but I love the bunnies and how cute they are. Okay, that's why I buy them. I don't celebrate the bunny. I don't worship the bunny, the bunny, the bunny, the bunny. But they are so adorable and God created the bunnies. There you go. <laughs> Baking cups. I do like picking these up. I'm very, very low on these because I make little um, cupcakes and stuff for here. I make brownie bites and stuff like that for snacks. So I always get these and put them away and use them. See that? It's so pretty. See? That's a pretty color, soft on the lips, so I like that. And that's from Dollar Tree. I love this, this is so cute. Let me show you what I got. Look at these oranges. I've gotta put this bag down and show you this. Look at these beautiful oranges. This is called Orange Stem. These are absolutely beautiful. I got one, two, three, four, and these are gonna be to decorate in my home this spring and summer. I'm thinking about maybe putting these on my seasonal tree and make it look like an orange tree. I don't know yet, or maybe just getting a vase. They are just so pretty. They are beautiful. I really like these, and they are absolutely gorgeous. Got 
some rub on transfers. This is very different. And you can just put this on something like maybe a board or something that you want to make for your home that you want to DIY. I am definitely going to use this. These pretty stickers. These are absolutely beautiful. I love stickers for journaling and doing different things. So I got that and I got this one, which are absolutely beautiful. These are great to get now for DIYs to decorate your home. This here, got some more of these tags for just different things that I do. So I really like those. So I picked more of those up and these are 16 piece. The wood frame with tin board. And I thought this was really nice. I'm gonna put make a, like a really nice um, display on the front and I'm gonna put it up on one of my walls and it's really pretty. Or you could just use it and hang like little notes and stuff like that, but I think it's so nice. I touched it with my fingerprints, so it's got. It. And the paper cups. When I lived in the Bronx, they used to be, um, they used to sell coquito. It's like little coconut ices in the Bronx and they would come in these white paper cups. So I got these so I can make coquitos. Some I use them for coquitos or I might use them for some kind of DIY. This I'm gonna put my cleaner, my orange cleaner that I made with the orange slices. It's gonna go in here and I'm gonna put, I'm gonna cut up some towels. They're gonna go in here for cleaning. So that's what I bought that for. I got some more of the baking cups. These are the bigger ones and I like this denim. They're pretty. So I picked those up for my baking. I like burlap. They, they look like burlap, but they're something else. I don't have my glasses on. There's another word for these, but I got the one with the bumblebee. I'm pretty, and I am definitely gonna be using this to decorate for, I'm gonna iron it out, and I'm gonna use it to decorate out there for um, this spring and summer. All the pretty bumblebees. So pretty. And then I just got the plain one to use it for whatever I want to use it for. These are nice. They remind me of um, like the flower sacks. Oh, so pretty. It's a little pin cushion. I love pin cushions. I love collecting them. And you just put it like this on your arm when you're sewing and you put your pins in. Isn't that pretty? So I really, really like that. Found some more of those lids that you saw me on the video with the potpourri that I made or because I'm gonna make some more of those potpourri, potpourri, potpourri fresheners. That's what happens when you're on a video for a long time. You just start talking funny. I found these really cute LED lights and they're little chicks and these are going to go around our little village. See how pretty those are? It's really cute crafting paper from Crafter Square and it is absolutely pretty and I am gonna definitely Mod Podge collages. These are absolutely beautiful. I am actually gonna edit this video to be a lot shorter because we're going on 30 minutes. So that's really pretty. So I picked up one pack for my granddaughter and I to have some fun. I picked up this galvanized envelope and I am going to be making a DIY with this for this craft room for the spring going to be making like a strip with hooks on it and it's going to be really pretty and I'm going to be using it in my craft room so I picked these up for $1.25 and they do come with the nails these are great if you're trying to like if you want to make something to hang coats just anything like that for your child's bedroom to maybe hang like their bags or stuff like that so I thought it was really cute and um it's just hooks so I picked up those and you can paint these and whatever color you want. Isn't that a beautiful jar? I picked this up because I'm gonna put my cotton swabs in here for my face. That's what I'm gonna do with these. So instead of having them in a box, I'm gonna take them out and put them in here in the litter box. I picked up some more of those for the litter. I like to have these when we clean out the litter box, so I go through these a lot. So I picked up, and these have about 60 pieces. So last but not least, I got the Freeman Clearing Peel-Off Clay Mask. And this is has um, sweet tea and lemon. So I bought that for $1.25. Freeman is very good. I have another one that I use all the time. I wanted to try the one with the lemon. This is great for your face, great for your pores. And um, that is it. I hope you enjoy this Dollar Tree haul.
<laughs> this was a long one, but I hope that you enjoyed it. You saw something fun. I'm going to go on ahead and edit this video because this is a long one. I normally don't make long hauls like this, but I wanted to share a homemaker's haul. I love making them. They're a lot of fun. I hope you had as much fun as I did and that you enjoy my different scenery and my poster. May God bless you all, and I'll talk to everyone soon. Bye. <laughs>